Hi guys, Kevin here from uh, Worthing Vapors. Um, today I thought I'd tell you a little bit about um, the, uh, the the EVOD. I've got a double pack here. Which, you know, it's well, for what it is. It's uh, it's the next step up from the uh, um, Cigalite cigarettes. Um, I'll go through that in a second. I mean, there it is. There it is. Um, I'll go, I'll go through it all in a minute when we go back down to the when we go down to the table. Okay. Um, I'm also going to show you around the ego twist. Um, I believe this is a 900 mile battery, same as the uh, ego twist. Um, but, uh, there you go. Right. Let's give this one a two. Um, I filled them up already, um, so I'll have to take you back in time, <laughs> right, to show you what, show you how to fill them, etc. Right, here, here goes for a toot for this. This has got butterscotch in it. Yeah, that's not too bad. Not too bad. I do like more butterscotch though. It's it's really good, really good. Right. Not a bad amount of vapor from these. Um. Personally, I don't use them very often, not the egos anyway. Um, for what it is, it's all right. It's 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 the next step up from the uh, the e-cigarette, and the other one that I've got here, which is full of red adair, or red adair rather. I keep calling it red adair. Isn't that some oil bloke out in Saudi Arabia or something? I don't know. Uh, I used to put fires out something, I don't know, anyway. Um, yeah, it's full of red stair. Um, let's give this one a toot. And... Now, I seem to get more vapour out of this one, which is why I use it as a switch between with my... Um, VV um, as opposed to the Ego Twist but the battery on this one doesn't last as long hence the reason why I bought the double pack um, it's a 900 mile battery which is you know there's, there's plenty it'll last you half a day or depending on how much you vape I mean I vape quite a bit I mean it's constantly me gob but uh, let's have another two of that because I really like that red stair Reminds me of the um, tunes. Reminds me of tunes, the uh, the cherry flavour tunes. Hmm. Very nice, very nice. Well, there you go, guys. Let's go down to the table and uh, I'll, I'll I'll walk you through them. Right. So here we are. We have the Evod. Now, as I said earlier, this is the uh, um, the, the double pack. Um, Evod. Open it up. What we got inside? Authenticity. Um, how to fill it up with uh, e liquid? Uh, it tells you that it's a bottom coil. Uh, suitable voltage difference for resistances. Hmm. 
I suppose you could buy different resistance uh, heads for it, etc. Yeah. And then we've got the EVOD manual. Um, as you can see, it's all in English, um, which is, 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 is brilliant. Um, what we've got here, we've got there's the uh, e EVOD e cigarette. Um, that part is the battery. There's your button there. That's what you use to take a toke with it. Um, turn it on, turn it off, etc. Uh, this hold this bit holds your liquid. Um, it's got two clear plastic windows. I wouldn't recommend high citrus juice for these because they could uh, bust the tank. Um, let's unscrew this and there, there's, there's your head. That's, that's your coil, you've got your coil and your, your, um, your wick in there. So if I can There's your wick and your coil, uh, your wick goes straight through your coil. But, uh, uh, that is the evil uh, customizer. Do that up fairly firmly, not over tight. You don't want to um, distort the threading in there. Uh, Pop that back on there for a minute. That to one side, and of course you've got um, you got your, as I said it's a double pack, so you've got a, a spare battery and a spare cartomizer. Now at the bottom here of the box, we've got. Um, if I can get into it with these double packs. They give you five free um, heads, and I believe that they're 2.5. I believe I haven't just tested the resistance on them. Oh, it says it on the box. I do beg your pardon. They're 2.2. They're, they're, they're 2.2 ohms. Okay. Right, pop that to one side. What we've got in this box? In this box, you'll find uh, the Kangatech charger. So, when you need to recharge your batteries, there you go. There you go, and that in plug that in plugs into uh, plugs into your uh, laptop or computer, whatever. Okay, so we'll put that on one side. Take that off of there. Put that there. <laughs> um, also in the box, you'll find that uh, they generally give you a. Um, a travel ad ad adapter type thing. Um, one end of it you stick your car, your um, USB cable in. The other end goes into the wall. Now, for some unknown reason, I've been given a uh, American plug, and of course, um, over here in England, we don't, we can't use those. So you you could I suppose if you use a travel adapter. Uh, I'm not really worried about it. I don't actually use this thing. Um, I use the computer method, which is uh, which is fine. Um, pop that back in there. Let's sell. <laughs> Does help if I get it back in. Sorry, I've got this annoying habit of making little 
funny noises. Right, so that goes back in there, bung that back in there, bung that back in. Oop, that goes up the other way. Yeah, plan. Right. Bung that back in there and we'll put that back in there just for tidiness. And we can keep this over here. Right, now, um, this one is um, the Ego battery with an iClear 16 on it. That's actually it's a blue iClear 16. I have got new ones, but uh, I haven't. Uh, I don't really like these cartridges because they do tend to go very, very quickly. Um, but each to his own, as they say. Uh, battery again, cartridge, or uh, uh, clearamizer go on it's the same same uh, same sort of uh, uh, configuration with uh, excuse me a second it's the same sort of configuration with the clay the um, the charging as um, as it is with um, the evod if I can find one there we go there we go, that's the one that came with this one, so you just screw it in, and again, bung that into your uh, USB port, or a travel adapter, or whatever. Um, right, now th there are no real main differences between these. They are basically the same. Um, in fact, I think that the the cut the uh, cartomizers are interchangeable. Uh, there you go. I mean, if you <laughs> it looks a bit weird, but there you go. Uh, pop that off. That's. Uh, I'm not doing right. Let's put the batteries to one side for a second and I'll show you how to fill these things up. Um, what am I going to put in them? I've got no idea. Hang on a sec. Oh well, right. Well, what I'll do is I'll put um, I'll put red astaire in one and put um, butterscotch in the other. They're my two main main vapes. Right to fill the um, evod, take off the head. Now, if you look down inside there you'll see that there's a little post you, your aim is not to get the liquid into that hole in the center there because if you do you're going to be tasting juice and that is disgusting well it is for me I, I mean there are, I know some people who actually like the taste of juice actually if you look down there you can actually see see the table Put that underneath there and you can actually see see the cartridge <laughs> there you go right so we'll put rid of stair in this one and get it down the side rather than that'll do only need a little bit right plug it back up making sure that that post post on top there goes down into the hole. Keep your cartomizer up straight, otherwise you'll have juice everywhere. Bung that down inside there and screw it up. Boom, boom, boom. Just like that. Okay. And then what you want to do is you want to put your battery back on top. Turn it up. I've noticed actually with these EVODs that if you don't keep the cartomizer tank 
flushed out every so often you do get a build up round the top round the top here of uh, of whatever juice you've got floating in it and uh, um, mine's red astaire so consequently it's gone red uh, we'll put that to one side for a second and we'll fill up the other tank now with these iClear 16s let's put that back over there these iClear 16s I found that uh, I, I, I don't know, there must be some method of, of taking the coil out and, and, and recoiling it, but uh, I haven't actually found out how to do that yet. Um, unscrew unscrew your, your plastic tip, that just comes out. Get your juice. And again, drip it down the side, making careful note not to go above well not too far not, um, yeah not to go above the plastic bung or the uh, the silica bung that's in there again if you do you're going to be tasting juice all right all right oh that do for that do for now it's a little bit in there. Right, screw your plastic lid back on. That's fine. Get your battery. Screw it back on your battery. Right now, these air goes. They turn on with uh, six on, six off. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, it's five on. I did beg your pardon. Five on, three, four, five, and five off. That's it. One, two, three, four, five, on. When the battery needs recharging on these, I believe that the um, the blue light actually comes on and stays on. Okay, so we've got it on. I'll put that down there, and we'll take a toke of that in a minute. Um, the EVOD, similar sort of thing. One, two, three, four, five on one two three four five off okay what one two three four five on okay right <coughs> excuse me I've got hay fever and it's uh, it's catching the back of my throat um, one thing I have noticed about the evods the batteries don't last quite as long as the egos so um, hence I've always got two of them on the go well I have I've always got I've always got this one on the go I don't use these very often um, but I do use which is on the same sort of principle it's the Inakin I taste VV um, that's that's the one that I use um, when I'm out driving. As you can see, I've got a, uh, um, an aero tank on there. I've got grapefruit in there. That's really nice, especially when you drip it. Um, but that's for another another video dripping. Oh, I've only just started getting that to myself. Right. Okay. So uh, let's go back up, and I'll give each of those a a two Let's see in a minute well there you go we're back up again um, I want to thank you guys for watching um, I hope you enjoyed the uh, the little walk through there for the EVOD and the uh, Ego Twist um, as I say these are my opinions only but as I said I, I I don't like the Ego Twist. I would much rather um, toke on this. I mean, put, to be quite honest, I mean, I would rather toke on something like this or even have a dripper, you know, because the flavour is just so much better. Oh.
loads of vapour. And there's a tow fan on there. Right. Okay. This is Whirling Vapours. Have a bright and pleasant day. And vape on, guys. <laughs>